Yo, can you hear me? Oh, yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Hold on one second, Aston. Let's see here. Change your Skype, bro. Too many haters, man. Oh, wow, wow. Um, I just gotta make I just gotta make sure everyone in the stream could hear you. Um, yeah. So, could you guys hear Aston in the stream, or is the gameplay too loud? Just let me know. Yeah, and thirsty. Uh, thanks for thanks for the raid, thirsty. Appreciate it. All right, you guys can. All right, so everyone can hear you. Um, so b before I start, you know, with anything else, um, I'm not sure if everyone in chat is actually familiar or know who uh, the. Lo do you go by Aston? Do you go by London Project? Like, what what, what do you guys? What do you like just, people just say call? The, just say the London Project. Yeah, the London Project. But um, you know, London Project. He's a zombie streamer in the community. Some of you guys are familiar with him. Um, some of you guys may not. Uh, be familiar, but basically, um, you know, you know, probably over a course of months, um, a lot of people, you know, had questions that they wanted to ask Aston, and um, he actually, you know, took me on my offer, and he decided he's gonna do an interview. So um, the whole point of the interview is, you know, just to, you know, I guess to clear some things up um, about Aston himself, and um, you know. Hopefully, you know, going forward, we can actually move on and just, you know, squash the whole topic. Uh, Gamerina, could you turn him up? Uh, hold on. Let me turn him up on Skype. Yeah, they said they can't hear you too high on Skype. Yeah, I'm going to turn him up on Skype so you guys can hear him. Give me one second. I'm on my phone now, so. Yeah, no, that, no, no, no. I, 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 I could turn up your volume on my end. Cool. Yeah, yeah. So I actually... Turning it up right now. Um, turn this up. Yep. So you sh you should be good. Um, but Aston, before I start, do you want to like introduce yourself or you know say anything before um we start with anything? Well, most of the know but knows about me, so I don't mind. But I can just talk about myself. I don't mind. Yeah, because some of my viewers, I'm not sure if they're familiar with who you are. Like, if you just want to say who you are, what you do, and... Um... All right, I'm a streamer on Twitch that streams zombies most of the time, you know? Every single day, with no break. I only play zombies, and yeah, that's what I do on this, on this, on this Twitch. You might heard about me, the London Project, so that's me. Anything else? Not, not that no that's pretty much it i, I think i'm gonna just um you know just start getting into it um right. you know so um a lot of a lot of viewers um you know ask this to multiple people that they see streaming on twitch including myself um you know they always want to know um you know when did you start playing zombies and who was your inspiration like why did you decide to you know start streaming on twitch like once it once it once it once it once it Okay. Mom, listen. I'm doing something. One set, bro. One set. Yeah, we'll just wait for London to come back, but. Oh, yeah, she's got a set. Bro, you want me to get a headphone so, I can, so you can hear me? Uh, I, I, I could hear you perfectly fine, and if sure? I, I could hear you fine, I think they could hear you. But whatever, whatever you want to get, that's, that's, it's totally up to you. Uh, it's it's fine, fine, all right. At the end of the day, if you can hear me, then it's fine, isn't it? So. Um... Yeah, yeah, I, I, I could hear you, and I, I'm sure they could hear you as well. But yeah, the, the first question I was asking is, um, you know, uh, when did you start playing zombies, and who was or what was your inspiration? Like, why did you side zombies, if, if anything? Yeah. Uh, first, first when I got into zombies because of my brother, you know, um, I started playing zombies when I was 16, and I finished school. I finished school and I came home. We used to say PS3, like share PS3. So he was playing Kino downstairs, and I came home and I was like, dude, what is what are you playing? I was like, he was like zombies. Then when he got from PS3, then I jumped to PS3, then we started playing. So then I started playing zombies, and yeah, and I, and I started addict, and I'm playing every day. So. 
my inspiration, you you might know about this guy. His name is the Call of Duty Zombie Project. You might know about him. Again. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm very familiar. I used to watch his so, content, like BO2 content. I I used to play. Um, I just started playing BO2 when I finished the exam. So and I was struggling. Like I was literally struggling. I couldn't. I couldn't find any things on the map. You know, I I don't know what to do. So I searched this guy on YouTube, and people like most of the people that I start playing on online. That was like, hey, Essen, check this guy out, man. He makes like good tutorial videos. So I went on YouTube and I searched that guy, Call of Duty Zombie Project. And he had like really good tutorial. And I started watching his video every single day, then it got me better at zombies. So that's the guy that inspired me to make my own YouTube channel. So yeah. Yeah, so you, okay. Yeah, no, that's that's pretty cool. So you started playing zombies, but why did you decide that you want to like stream zombies on Twitch? Like, why not just, you know, play it casually and just do YouTube? Why why, why actually come on, on Twitch, um, you know, streaming? But for when, I, when I was playing zombies, yeah, at BO2, I don't even know anything about Twitch. And the only thing I know about is YouTube. So I was playing town, you know, it's a public game, so like random people. And most of the most of them are left, so they just when they die, they just leave the game. You know, most of them are on a public game, so only there's only one guy and me left on the game. So I took that guy to 150, and then then we died. Then the guy messaged me on um, on PS3. Then it was like, hey man, you should stream on Twitch. People will, will watch your stream because you're really good at zombies. And I was like, what is Twitch? Then I started researching about Twitch. Then um, then started streaming, man. Yeah, on on Twitch. So you might know about this girl that. She name is the the, I think her name is Call of the Dead, Un Uncall of the Dead. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Call me on call me on yeah, dead. Yeah call me on dead. Yeah, yeah, call me on dead. Um yeah I, I definitely remember her because I remember when I first started streaming. I think like my second stream I was playing Town and she dropped in my yes. stream and she was giving me some pointers and she was the one who actually yes. showed me how to download the time. A very nice girl. I like her a lot. She did, she's not on or she hasn't streamed. Last time I saw her stream was a Moon Co-op World Record game. But yeah she was. Very cool. Yeah, I, I like her a lot. She's very down to earth. Um, mm. Very cool. Very cool. Um, so she sort of like helped you out and, you know, yeah, stuff when like I, When I was streaming on Twitch, she's the girl that came to the stream and she was like, hey man, you should do these type of things. You know, it's, you know when you take the zombies and kill inside the, um, the bar? Yeah, it's yeah. It's like the spawn control. So she teach me about the things and then got me better in town. I was really bad at town and she, and she got me better. So yeah, she's the girl that um, made me get better at town. That's the guy that met on Twitch. Or, uh, yeah, at, at the at the at the time when I first started streaming, and, and I I looked up to to see like who is this girl who actually decided to help me out. I didn't realize she was such a good zombie player. You know, she had a YouTube ch channel, and you know some of the things that she did um, was just. I was like, wow, that's, that's pretty cool. I hope but, she's all right, man. I don't see her anymore on Twitch. Yeah, um, she, mm. she's pretty good friends with Discreet, so I, I think I could, you know, send him a message to see um, mm. exactly, um, you know, how she's doing. But I, I think probably busy with uh, college and stuff like that. But, um, mm. yeah, so then, you know, brings us into the next question. So, you know, you've been streaming on Twitch. You've been a part of this community over, you know, a couple of years now. So yeah, what is your what is your opinion of the community? Oh, like, this community. Um, there's so much thing I can talk about this community. But the first thing, more this community is full of kids, you know, because Call of Duty is most of the people that plays Call of Duty is full of kids, you know, like under, under 18. Um, like they they listen to what other people say. For example, um, they go to other people's stream and they and the, the streamer is gonna be like, hey, listen, the London Project is a bother. He's a hacker. He do, he does a lot of things, and these people just listen to what they say, and they talk. Then they, then they, then they start talking shit about um the person. That's what this most community is all about. They just they they listen to what other people say. Like they just they don't use their brain, you know. They just, just like you know what it's because this person talking shit about this person that's true. So let's just believe it. That's what this comedy is all about, bro. Yeah, no, I, I I stop by your chat and I see I see it every day. But um, but why why do you guys why do you think people give you a hard time and you know um why you know because I see in your chat and you say it all the time. People are sending bots 
um to your your channel like like why is 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 it something that you did or you think people mm -hmm. just hate you like you know there has to be like something behind it like to spark mm -hmm. all this hate you know because um it just don't start from nothing you know like what what do you think mm -hmm. or you know looking back you think like just started this and you know maybe people start getting like a a bad view of you and then sort of like other people jumped on the bandwagon like could you mm -hmm. recall like a an event that you think you know, started all this um you you know lo you know about me back in you you remember the london game of 28 oh yeah oh, yeah i i know your old account yeah i used to stream my old accounts on 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 the on the account you know back in the day like like year, like one year now you know yeah yeah um that I was I was just the origin of everything we did. Just go for the world record as I can, you know. Just go higher one as I can. Origin. So most of the people that um they don't like playing people that playing origins, you know. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna name those people, but most of the people that say that oh it's because this guy playing origins, he's a he's a, he's a v hole, you know. Because when you play origins, you get more v's. You get it? Yeah, so, yeah. I, I like origins. My origins is like a really good map. I just, just I love that map. So I've been playing that map every single day. So the people come to me saying, oh, this guy's a V hole. Um, all he cares about Vs, you know, because he's uh, only playing or only playing Origins. Like I said, when you have a title, the world record time on the title, you get more Vs, you know, because people gonna people, most of the kids are gonna like that, you know, or because oh, this guy's going for world records, so let's just go click on his channel and watch it, watch him. How is he gonna do that game? So yeah. those this this high rank community, they just they don't like those type of things, or because he, this guy has a world record time on the title, and all he plays is Origins. Um, for VHOP, so that's how this hate started, man. And I just I used to get views like around 80, 90, 100 views back in the day, you know, on my, on my old account, Lana Gamer 28. And that time I, did, I didn't get my channel B boarded. And then, um, then and I got a new job, you know, in a NHS hospital. Then I left, I left Twitch, so it was a full time job, so I couldn't stream all the time, you know. So I was like, you know what, let's, let's, let's delete my channel and just, 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 um, just continue with my work. And came back and just made a new account called The London Project. I started, I, I streamed on my old account, The London Gamer 28. I, started, I, st I was streaming it. And I was still getting so many hates. People, people like, why are you still playing Origins? I thought you died. you ISIS. In the, there was, there was posting a lot of bad things about me. And I was like, you know what, let's just start fresh and just make a new account. So I made a new account, The London, the London Project. And, and people was like, ask some poor face guy on bro, because it's gonna be, people going to like that. And you get more views. I was like... Let's put my face cam on and start interacting with my viewers. And when I started putting my face cam on, that's when I started getting so much hate. You know, people start calling me, "Oh, this guy is a fucking Indian. He's ISIS. A lot of bad things, bro." And that's when my channel started getting v boarded every every single day. Every single day when I go when I go live, v my channel get v boarded and chat boarded. You know what chatbot is, right? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know when. Uh, yeah, I know what chatbot is, and yeah, I, I see it in your chat. Uh, sometimes I see it in my chat. I don't know who's doing it, but um, but yeah, that's like a, a separate story. But um, I saw that you you create a recent video um that you you know published. That. Yeah, that you published mm -hmm. today. That you went into you know a lot of these things. You know a lot of the hate that you have been getting over the years and how you have handled it and mm -hmm. um. You know, a lot of times I say on my channel, because, you know, I see it myself, like, you know, the the zombie community, people who are, like, true fans of zombies, they watch uh, multiple mm -hmm. streamers. Um, so, you know, some people come over to my channel and they say stuff. And, you know, what are your views of uh, Aston, uh, the London Project? Like, what do you think of him? And, and, you know, and through all this, you know, I've, you know, always said to people um, when I look and i see your channel and i see that you're constantly streaming like i don't know anything about viewbotting or any of that stuff i don't have any proof of it so i never like accuse anyone of like viewbotting but like what i've told people you know you know mm -hmm. over time is that you know you and probably a couple of others I, I i think are the most like consistent streamers and with anything in life you know if you're trying to build something or grow something is that daily grind you know you're streaming even on days that you don't want to stream and you know i constantly see you streaming and you you put in the amount of time and i'm sure for like a lot of your viewers it's sort of like a regular place for them to be like probably when they get off school they know that oh you know what london project is going to be streaming so i'm going to be here and they have other friends in the chat even though 
you know, all the other stuff that's going on. I'm sure like a lot of people, they're like your true fans. And I see, you know, some of the comments that are mentioned in the posts. And um, one particular comment that, you know, kind of struck me from the, the video that you created that I didn't know much information about, um, you know, um, there's this one guy, I don't recall the name. I think a lot of people could go through and look at London's video and you guys will see it in the comment section. So one person said that um, they were, I guess, you know, what I was getting from it is they were kind of angry after the incident that happened between you and Fixu. So yeah. um, it's up to you if you want to get into it or yeah, you just want to clear it up. Take, um, take goodbye, take goodbye. Yeah, the whole Fixu incident. Um, so a lot of people accuse you of uh, getting Fixu banned from the community. So I, I, I don't, oh, banned from Twitch. Um, um, so, yeah, if you want to get into that or yeah. just, sh you know, shine more, some more, Most of the hate just started because from that. Yeah, yeah. Um, bro, I, I was on Sultanat's stream and he was playing Shangri-La, you know? I was like, you know what, um, let's go to his channel and let's throw Sultanat. And I, I was like, hey, man, I just got the uh, fix your banded. Because he got banned because people was reporting him, you know? Because he already got banned on Twitch before. Because he, um, he, apparently he was going to dust someone on, on uh, when, when he was playing a corp, you know? And someone you said uh, reported him, and he got banned from Twitch. And and I was like, you know what? And and when I seen his channel got banned, I was like, dude, that's bad, man. Then I went on Sultan and I was like, yo, Sultan, I got a fix your ban, but I did not do anything um to fix it. I didn't even tell my viewers to go on a, to fix his channel to report. And then people start uh, coming to my stream and they start harassing me. You got that guy banned. All you do is play Origins and you shoot zombies, and you just got that legend banned on Twitch. And I was getting so many hates, bro. I, like, I don't know what to say. Then I messaged Fixu. And I told Fixu on, on, on a kick. I was like, hey, dude, man, I didn't do anything to you, bro. If I, have, if I hate someone, I just ignore them. I just don't do any bad things about them. I don't talk shit about them. Back in, the, back in the day, bro, I used to be a childish, you know? Yeah, like, yeah. I used to make drama, like talk shit about people, you know, on, on stream. Like, when I get hates, I just, I just reply to those people. And... That's how the hate started, bro, because of the Fixu. I even told Fixu, like, hey, man, I never reported your channel, and I never told my viewers to go on your channel to report you. Never said anything, man. And then it was like, don't worry, bro. Then, then it was like, just just, just forget this about. Then then that's when the uh, hate started, man. Then people started ch chatboarding my stream and um, reboarding my channel when I made a new account, the London Game of... The London Game of... Um, the London Project. So every single day, bro, when I go live, my channel get chopped on it for calling me, oh, this guy is a packy. Why are you come back? Why are you coming back to Twitch? You got Twitch, you got fixed or banned from Twitch. So you're a fucking packy. Go back to your country. Why are you in England? A lot of bad things, but every single day, when I go live, boom, my channel get chopped on it. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I see some of the, the comments that are posting your chat, and I think they're, you know, a little bit too over the, the top. You know, whoever is doing it, what they're writing uh, is over the top. And, um, you know, after the whole Fixu incident, and I'm, I'm sure you guys worked it out because you guys actually played a co-op game together. And, yeah. you know, I, I don't know why people didn't really see that, but, you know, I guess people were just – you know, there there are people behind the scenes that are hoping for drama and like just pushing it. Like, oh no, he got fixed to ban, but they're like talking and they worked it out. Like, you need to also move on. You know, like you know, they're just holding on to it. And uh, I think those are one of the things that you know we see a lot of in the community. Like, you know, you know, people have their fans, and um, if you do something or say something about someone that they like, you know, they sort of like defend it. And even if you work it out with the actual person directly, they're still like not dropping it. And um, I think, you know, that's probably one of the things that, you know, probably escalated it a little bit uh, further. Um, but the the other thing that, you know, I wanted to, to ask you is um, I see, you know, I, I go on, uh, on YouTube when I, uh, I've scrolled on YouTube and I, I came across like a, a couple of videos and, you know, I saw people made a couple of Expos videos of you. Like, mm -hmm. are you aware of, you know, some of those Expos video London Project did this and, you know, they have like a four or five minute like footage. Like, um, yeah, do yeah, one, one thing. Let, let me let me finish that. Um, okay. Game of it. Um, I, I stream on Twitch, bro, because people like me the, the way I am, you know? Because mm -hmm. I'm an entertainer streamer. I just I do anything I can just to make people laugh, you know? Like I'm people like me the way the way I am. So not everyone's gonna like me, you get it? 
everyone has everyone is going to get hate you know you can't stop it for example this person likes you but like two months later this another guy's going to come to your stream and be like oh this guy's a douchebag so he's not going to like you so that's what i'm saying but i never be bored in my twitch channel and i want him to do those type of things and when when i get when i get be bored before the uh, game on you yeah. and people people always tells me ask them why did you just end your stream and comes back he just cuz the is cuz the ball so i was doing you guys uh, i was doing it like every day you know when when i when, it, when, it, when my channel get be bored i just end my stream and comes back so i can't do the all the time you get a game on you it's yeah, going to yeah. it's going to piss a lot of people off you know a while this guy keep on ending his stream yeah yeah so no, no, I, I, I completely understand it too. I, I think a lot of times, you know, what viewers don't understand, um, I guess you as a streamer, especially if you have nothing to do with it and someone is view bot in you, there's, there's pretty much nothing you could do. Like you could probably put it in a title and I, I guess according to Twitch, Twitch doesn't like you like fully acknowledging it or like talking about it, you know, like you know, just report yeah. it, let them handle it, like, because there's not much you could do, you don't know exactly who's doing it, doing what, it's just all speculation, so just, just report it, and leave it up to them, let them investigate, and let them, you know, try yeah, to it, figure it out. Like I said, bro, this, this community is, is based on kids, uh, young people, you know, kids, yeah, under yeah. 18, so if, if when my channel get v boarded so if I put my title, oh, I got v boarded you know, so if, if I keep on doing that, that guy's gonna keep on doing it every single day, you get it? So he's yeah, gonna yeah. be on my stream every single day because I'm giving that guy attention. So what's the point? He's gonna keep on doing it again. So I just, I just, that's why I just ignore these people. I just continue my streaming. And I also, when my channel go v before and people start harassing me, I'm a v border and I v I, I just, I just, I do these type of things to get views, you know. And I couldn't take it. Then I, I sent an email to Twitch staff. I even spoke to them on a Skype as well, and I told them about it. Hey, uh, what can I do? People harassing me, and um, they calling me v and I was not doing it. I'm not going to take a blame that um, I haven't done anything wrong. And I told him, so they was like, hey man, you just need to ignore, bro. You can't stop this. You just have to ignore and just continue streaming. That's what I've done, bro. And every time when people come to my stream, like, you're a V-Ball. I just, just ban them and just continue streaming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I, I, I completely understand because I've been, <laughs> I've been the the victim like several times, and I know like there's not much you could do. Um, so you you stream a you stream a lot on Twitch, and you do high round gameplay, and mm -hmm. um, you know you 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 tell your what? fans that you you know you play your games legit. Um, but and in the community we have a website, Zombie Records. I'm sure yeah. you're familiar with it. Um, you know, like what's your view on Zombie Records or why why you don't submit <laughs> your videos to Zombie Records? There's nothing wrong with that, but I'm I'm just yeah. asking. I'm just curious because a lot of people ask me all the time. You know, I always see Aston on these high rounds, but he doesn't even have a uh Zombie Records profile. Like, what's going on? Like you know does it mean that he's not legit because he's not on the website like 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 why um, i'm just curious bro first thing is bro um i don't hate that website the zombie record website you know it runs by older people you know you and firefly you guys are older, you know you guys you guys are older than me i respect that um i don't have any problem on that website. but it's just that the people that are somewhere on the website i'm not going to name those people uh let's just say quick all right quick 925 so I, I don't have any problem with that guy. That guy he he raided my stream and he hosted my stream when 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 he got in, when he started uh Twitch, you know, when he started streaming on Twitch. And and then then the guy started listening to what my haters say. So on the record. I mean started listening to what the people say. And then the guy started hating on me, calling me I'm a hacker and um apparently apparently um, I I cheated to get high run, you know? So those people that they just they're making that website look so bad, you know. For example, let's say I and Steve and um Scotty, so they are really good players. So they saw me on that website, and I listen to what they say. For example, they help other people to get better zombies, you know. Yeah, I yeah. I respect that um I and Steve, but these type of people they're making that website look so bad. You get it, bro? And all, I don't I don't play my I don't go for high run just because of the um. Yeah, yeah. No, it's it's it's, compl website. it's completely understandable. Um but um I know I know you you you're not required to 
like respond to some of these questions but a lot of times when you know when people you know criticize you of some games they're not legit or anything like you know you're hiding something um mm. you know why in i know you you don't have to do this but why not just say you know what i'm gonna put all my gameplay on my youtube and you guys could go through it i know my whole entire game is mm -hmm. legit um here's the thing like uh, you know why why you just don't just just put it out there so people could go through they would see it and this boom it would just be done because you know all the footage is there so there's nothing that people could argue about like i said bro this this community hates me man even even if i post full gameplay on my channel they're still gonna hate on me you know um like i'll go i'll go over high run and i always like every time when i finish my high run gameplay and i always post on my youtube channel you know and, and people say what is it and some of them are just just type bad negative comments on my video or, or this guy clicks to get this high run, you know? But most of the people that say that, they came from the website, your website, Zom Records. So that's what this that's what this pisses me off. But I just don't play my zombie game just for the website. No, I no, I I completely understand, and um, I know some yeah, you know, some of these people yeah, they yeah, they definitely submit to to zombie records, but um, like what I. You know, you, you're not you're not required to respond or anything, but you know, like what I say, like you know, for for certain situations or maybe like you know, one game or anything that you know you do know that you you know you have all the footage, you have everything, you know, just yeah. say boom and just just clear it and you know hopefully people can move on and they stop arguing about like old stuff because i see you playing your, your giant and you know your last game you died on 181 and you know you did pretty well on that map and i don't know people can't accuse you of modding giant because there's no mods out for console giant, yeah 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 so um yeah so um you know people do know like people who play zombies they do know that you know no, this guy's an actually good player, and they could watch and they could actually see that. But um, you know, I think some of the things, um, you know, it, it choice is totally up to you. Is that you know some of the things that you could pro you probably can't like get rid of all your haters. That's not gonna happen. But some of the things you could actually yeah, I like, can stop the hate. Just, just, cl yeah, just, just clear it up. Say, boom! I, I gave you guys everything. I don't want to talk about it. I'm moving on, and I, I don't care about it. Or if there's something that you want to talk about, like some game you did in the past or something, um, you know, just put it out there, and we just move forward. Because to be honest with you, regardless of what comes out of most of these games, like I said. A lot of people watch you for you, you know, watch you for to see how you're going to fail, you know, and it's not as much about the actual gameplay, you know what I mean? Like, you know, it's not a, about the actual gameplay because I, I, I've told you in the, the past I watch a lot of your games, not because, you know, I think that you're going for world records, you know, I'm just curious to see what's going to happen along the way. And that's that's why I watch, you know, not because, you know, oh, London's going to get the record. That's not why I watch it. I think, uh, you know, a lot of your viewers viewers it's probably the the same way they're just there for entertainment yeah and it's it's nice it's nice that you're on a high round but that's mm -hmm. not really why they watch but yeah yeah true but game on you your, your website has a lot of rules you know rule, rule, rule. yeah yeah you have to go through the rules if you want to if you want to be on that website so for yeah. example let's say shot with the flag you know yeah yeah i i, I understand using the flag is, is, is not good because you can keep you can keep on spamming and getting ammo you know come on that's not that's not legit but that's why I like I like playing like that, you know. So I'm not gonna s stop playing. I'm not gonna stop doing it just because of, um because your website no 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 you know? no. I, I I to be honest with you, you could play your game however you want to play it because th there are people in the community mm -hmm. who mod and do other things and test things and you know they make it apparent to other people that you know i'm actually testing because you know people always call you out you know the people are always looking for you to make a mistake and like oh i'm gonna call you out on this like you know so they you know they put it out there you know very clear so people know that you know this is exactly what i'm doing so there's no deception um so it's you know it's kind of it, it's it's kind of it, it's a, it's totally up to, to you you know you play your game however you want to play your game but um and i think what a lot of people are you know partially like angry about is they say you know if london's gonna play shadows and say to war record 
why would he not you know try to do it like what the other players did you know play by the same rules and you know get as high as he can and i think that's where people have an issue with it is you're going for like or you you put in your title that you're going for a record which is fine but the the way you're going about it is not uh, you know not the way how you know people want to see it yeah Yeah, and i i think that's the the issue that some people have with it like i could care i don't really care what you put in your title you could say whatever you want (laughs) you know in your title but um the, yeah, the moment you're saying that you're going for a record, you know, I would expect that you're playing it a certain way. A lot of even a lot of people in the community would say, well, he's going for the record. So, you know, everything is going to be legit or by most of the standards that the community, um, you know, say is acceptable. So, you know, that's the, the only thing you know, will be like my recommendation. You could play you could play with flags if you want. You know, just, you know, just let everyone, I'm, I'm playing with, you know, if you say it however you want, I'm road to around 250 with flags or whatever. I wouldn't have a problem with it because it's, you're, you're up front with exactly what you're going to do. So no one could be deceived. You'd be like, oh, it's in my title, bro. So, you know, it's exactly what I'm doing. So, you know, that's the, the only thing, you know, I had to say, but, um, but before we wrap this up, do you have like anything you want to, you know, mention or anything that I missed that you want to talk about or, you know, you're, um, you're... you said about, um, exposed videos on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. Um, mo- mo- most of the people, they make exposed video, man, just because they want, they want me to look so bad, you know? Yeah, yeah. For example, look what happened in my origin game, 145, and they made an exposed video maybe that no proof. How how can how can you call a someone? How can you call a murder? Right? If you have a proof, all right, that's fine. You know, that's um. Oh, look, this guy has a proof that he he murdered this game, dude. He's he made an exposed video of me without no proof. Have you seen his? Have you seen the video fully? Um, I've seen, I I've seen, I've seen part of videos. Yes, yeah, I've, I've seen a couple. He was kept on, he was kept on spamming me, chat. Hey, man. Um, hi, Hassan, did you, is your game is over 40 plus? Hey man, is your, is your game is over 40 plus? And I was getting so many messages and I was reading everyone's comment that I, that, that, that guy was kept on spamming because I was like, no, it's, it's under 40 plus. So how's that, how's that modded the game on you? How's that proof that I modded my game? Yeah, it's well, well, the only thing, you know, like I said before about some of those issues, like if, if you have the, the video recorded or some of the footage in your own defense, you could say, you know what? Here's my, old, my here's all the footage. I know I didn't mod my game. Here's the footage, like, and just just leave it like that. You don't have to explain yourself or anything. Like, you know, let whoever is accusing you let them go through if they want to go through and if they're digging for something. But it's it's totally up to you. But what I'm saying is, like, if you in your for you, if you don't say like, like for example, let's say you know I got to like my Mamba Mamba the Dead game for example, I got to two twenty three and I claimed it as the record, and if I don't re- release the the footage for like majority of the game or critical money, parts of the game, basically what people are gonna say is that you know what, I don't think this game is legit. You know why? Because you know if he knew that he did that, and we all play zombies, and it's something you're you're proud of, you just re- release the footage. You got the footage, what, what you got to hide. So, um, you know, it doesn't mean that you're guilty by not having the footage, but it doesn't help you by not providing the footage. You know, people make up you know all these other things, and um, it, it just doesn't help your situations. But it's like I said, it's it's totally up to you like how you choose to handle it but um if if i were you like i'm looking in your shoes if i were you and if i have the the footage for those low rounds i record it just post it you don't have to submit to zombie record just put it on your channel put it somewhere and say you know what i know my game is legit i have my footage here you go and i'm sure people can't argue with it because you know if you have the game plan people look at it can't find anything there's nothing that people could accuse you of so um yeah that's yeah that's my take on it bro i i even i was gonna upload your full gameplay remember that day i was i spoke to you, um, you yeah and yeah and i post a full gameplay on each on your on your zombie record so to, to, to all these people that i haven't modded my game and you you guys even told even firefly even told me that um um i said you can't post that gameplay because the um the website doesn't let uh people that play offline mode on pc on bo3 
So, so she told me, you know, you can't, um, you can't play. Um... Yeah, well, <laughs> well, the the I I haven't tested this myself, but the claim was that your that Origins game was forty hours worth of gameplay. I haven't tested it myself yet, but some people, what they're saying is it's impossible. There's no way you could play for that long without the game crashing. But how the fuck? I mean, how, how did they know that? Uh, how did they know uh, uh, my game was 40 plus? How? I, I, I don't know. You don't oh. play with a timer. I don't have the full foot, yeah, footage. I, I, that's I, that's what I'm I, saying. I, I don't know, but I but that's what I'm just telling you. Based on Just based on that, what they they say, and also the other claim was I think I'll have to go back through the, the footage. I, I guess people will say, well, you know, I saw London on 130 and he only had like a thousand kills or two thousand kills. Like the kills didn't make sense. So, you know, based on that, they're like, well, he must have modded this game. Like, you know, but I don't, I don't have screenshot of it or anything, but that's basically the accusations that are basically out there. Kills don't make sense. Um, it's impossible. Like there's no way. And that's why I say in your, like, if I were you and I have the footage, just, you don't have to explain it to anyone. Just say, you know what? I have full gameplay on my YouTube or wherever you, you put it. And, you know, that would be the end of it. But like I said, but if you, if you have a proof, if you think my game is um, hack modded, if you have a full proof, then you can just show to everyone, you know, that my game is um, modded. So making this, bro, um, I was, you know, a lot of people told me, you know, a lot of people told me on Snapchat, on Twitter, what's going on in this community. They yeah. even made a fake picture of me that um, I had my uh, V-Body channel behind my back. Be behind my my PC. Apparently, I had my apparently I had a Vivo program behind my PC. You know, they used that to get me banned from Twitch, and also they made a um bullshit about me uh on my thing. You know, of my um Twitter. You, have you seen that one on the Twitter? They, uh, um apparently they, apparently the guy asked me, did you monitor the Origins game? And uh, apparently I replied back um yes I did. I monitored I monitored my I mean I monitored my Origins games for a sub button. So yeah. what kind of nonsense is that game money? Yeah um. I, I, I don't know how people do these things with like Photoshop or whatever. And that's why I say like in when, when people ask me like about one particular thing, like mm -hmm. if the entire gameplay is there or if people say, you know, Aston did this and they say, well, the gameplay is here. I could go through and I'll, I could I could skim through and I could look through it. And if I see anything that I think is does it make sense? I'll, I'll call you out on it. I'll be like, yo, Aston, I don't think this this seems right, you know? And, you know, that would clear it. That would, you know, I guess you could either, you know, respond to it or, or not. But not having the gameplay available, I, I can't really say much here or there, you know? You can't really say whether it's legit or not. You know, there's accusations. But, like I said, it would have it would just help the situation just to move on and not talk about that Origins game if the full gameplay was provided. But um, another thing is um, the 145 is not as relevant anymore because you know 145 is wouldn't have it's would not be the world record currently. That record has been beaten, and 147 now is the record. But at the time. You know, 145 was like the highest that anyone have seen on Origins. Like, wow, Aston got to 145. I've never seen that before. And I was so many. I was people was kept on telling me, you know, oh, how can you get 145? And it's it's impossible to get 145. Yeah, yeah. It is it is possible to get 145. Yeah, so it is like, possible. Kind of yeah, rocks rocks wrong and um, Katon got to 147. And yeah, it, it is possible, but what what I'm saying is that that Origins record at 144 is like a special one for a lot of people because that record stood for a long time. It stood for over a year, and Origins is one of the most popular maps on BO2, and you know people enjoy Origins, and um, you know a lot of people knew about the amount of time that Willio had to put into the map, you know, just to get the record. I believe he played it like over that whole summer. That's the only map he played and then he got the world record and a oh, lot of people yeah it felt like you know what london was just taking shortcuts he was just cheating his way and it's just disrespectful and he shouldn't have done that and um yeah i think that's why you know some people were angry about it only origin is is not is not a skill based of map you know is it easy all you do is get the ice stab and camp until you get 100 is to, to beat the record game you need to you need to beat you need to get the 100 fastest you can 
get that 100 fast as you can. Then, then you had to um, you had to watch out for this ammo, you know. Yeah, if yeah. You on, if, you, if you keep on watching the ammo, trust me, you can beat the bot. That map it does not based on skills. And when I played my origin game, okay, on you, I was playing all night without getting there's no sleep. And I was playing all night. I took like two hours sleep and started streaming. And I was streaming for um, 24 hours, not 24 hours, like 12 hours straight. You know, I was streaming from I was streaming whole day when I was playing that game. I started that game um, on the on the on at uh, night, like around 12 p.m. and um, I started streaming in the morning, you know, early. Yeah, to yeah. Do 24 stream. Then got the 145, and the people was like, people was like, oh, that he he um he hacked that game. But if you think that my if I hacked that game, so show show me a proof though on you. I just want the proof. All right, just want the proof. I'm not I'm not gonna just sit there for uh, and uh, talking about this uh, and uh, tell t- talk about this to in front of the kids that um under 18 and just that you talk that you show those people that oh I don't have more of my game you know I'm not gonna do that I'm 21 years old and I'm not gonna waste my time uh, talking about talking about this to in front of a kids yeah you know yeah what I'm trying to say on you? no I, I I completely I I understand what you're 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 saying and um like like what I was saying like I what I said is if I was in your shoes like I agree like going back and forth like arguing back and forth it's just a waste of time it's not productive. But um, if you, you know, if you have the gameplay and you say, you know what, I have nothing to hide, just just post it somewhere. And I'm sure that would that would squash like any arguments like having full footage, you know, you, you just no one can't argue. It's the footage is there. No one could, you know, dispute like certain things. I'm sure, you know, it would it would have cleared out like like all these things and it wouldn't like people still wouldn't talk about it but like i said it's not as important um now at, than you know like if we were if we were having this interview like 2 months ago it would probably be a lot more relevant cuz no one have ever seen a 145 on origins like no one have gotten or you know ammo luck have gotten to that point yet but now that it's broken people are not talking it about it as much cuz it's you know, it's no longer the world record, but, you know, back then, I, I think, you know, if you would have just provided the, the footage, I think it would have helped you, um, I'm not saying that would, you, you would have not have any haters, like, coming out of it, because, you know, people are going to hate regardless, like, if you don't have any haters, um, mm-hmm. you know, like, <laughs> you know, it, it's probably something, there's always, gonna, there's always going to be haters, you can't please everyone, but, they, but there's always going to be haters. Most of the people, they use my origin game just to hate on me more you know but I most of they think that i'm going to take them serious you know they come to the same and that they start talking about my origins game and how I, um how about how i modded my game you know all the little 20 years old kids think that i'm aston is a legend player they use that just to uh just to get my attention but it doesn't work on me you know yeah. i'm not going to sit here and i'll give it the little kids that sit in front of the keyboard and all day and they're trying to make a drama yeah they, yeah like, no no let's I... say let's say v-boy you know Let, they, I, my channel get people every single day, and they, and they just don't like me. They just want me to get banned from Twitch so bad. So, and they're going, bro. I get so much uh, or message on on Snapchat. People tell me, hey, son, I was on this guy's stream. And I'm not gonna talk about that guy's stream, but I was on his stream, and he was calling me Vibo. So, this this community is just it just full of brain brainless people. They just like they judge people without knowing them. You know? Yeah, yeah. That's how this community is all about. That's what I'm saying, man. I, that's, this is why I don't want to be part of this committee. That's why I don't want to um part of your website, Zombie Record. You know, I don't hate I don't hate your website. You don't want to be part of this community. No, uh, yeah, there, there's absolutely nothing wrong with being a part of the community, playing your game, and mm-hmm. not submitting it to any website. There's 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 nothing wrong with that. You know, it's a it's an optional thing, um, but. Um, you know, the, the things that, you know, people, 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 you know, your haters is sort of like using that, like the fact that you're, you're, you're not providing certain information, using that as, you know, their advantage, you know, just to, you know, spark other people like, you know, London's hiding something, you know, cause we all know he got the footage. He's hiding it, bro. He's hiding it. That's why he don't want to post it somewhere. So, um, you know, the, it, the, I'm just being honest. That that is just just not helping your case. Like you know, yeah. there are there are nice people on this community. You know, there, there are really good people. Especially you, some of your viewers. Like let's say let's say um the I what his name is. 
he he's one of my twist sub and and these are the people today they're really nice good people you know good people to talk to you got it there yeah, are nice yeah. people on this community and there's there are some douchebag on this community you know no i i i trust me i i i i understand it i i i completely agree there there are people in the community who you know i would say just avoid at all cost and there are a lot of but there are you know i believe that there there are a lot more good people in the community than bad people and you should not let the bad people like influence how you like interact with other people because you know you know over time you know like you know they're you know they're constantly hearing certain things and um you know they you know people could be like persuade uh, like one way or another but like 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 I said the whole origins thing um you know if if it was me in your shoes and I do have the footage I would have posted there I'm not saying you have to submit to zombie records just 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 post it somewhere and say you know what I I reveal all the footage um and you know my my game is completely legit um and you know here's my proof and you know no one no one will be able to argue with it okay, like, if you want me to post i don't have the full gameplay right now game i, I my pc got hacked you know i had to give up my pc and i got new one i raised money for the pc three thousand pound you know and i got the new pc right now so if, if you if you want me to post the full gameplay i can't get it anymore so i had to play another game on origins if i want to yeah, so then, that, yeah, but I'm yeah. not gonna start another game just for a little, no. just to yeah, make a little I, yeah, I, I, yeah, I'm not saying to, to, to start another game. Yeah, the footage from that particular game, if you have it, um, you know, I would, I would have like, if I were you, I would have just post whatever I have, and just, just, just move on, just, just leave it like that. You know, my footage of my game, it's online like and you know i don't want to you know deal with it anymore and you know people people just people just move on you know we just move on bo3 is out like we're playing bo3 you know people are having a good time and um a lot of that stuff is not as uh like r relevant as what it was when bo3 wasn't out you know so um but you know one thing i would say for you like i've told people over and over you know you know because people you know tell me oh, i can't believe you know you you actually watch uh london project streamer <laughs> or london project uh stream and you know i i go on your stream all the time and i chat to you know your viewers in chat and i just chill back and just watch to you know, just just to watch to watch gameplay, and I'm sure there are other people who do the the same thing. Not necessarily, you know, just watch for world records, but you know, what I would say for you is, you know, you're consistent. You want to grow your channel, and um, you're putting in a lot of time. Like you're streaming almost every day, and um, I think a lot of people should respect that because not many people are willing to put in the time required to either grow your channel or other things it's it's very easy to just complain you know they just look back and say oh this guy made this mistake and this guy doesn't deserve this but you know you don't see anyone like outworking you like putting in more time so just you know you're doing a good job with your your channel regardless of what other people are saying and just you know just continue doing the right things and um you know, just time will tell, you know, everything else will pan out and you know, everything I, I, will be fine. I, I stream on Twitch here only, uh, just to entertain people, you know, just to make yeah, people yeah. laugh. But I'm not going to take this game too serious. You get it, like these people on, on it, on Twitch, get, getting over, holding over my um, Origins game, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm trying, to, I'm trying not to rust, but I'm trying to... Yeah, yeah. It, you know? So... They they get too overhyped for one game. Yeah, yeah. Well, so so so, so someone someone just typed something in my chat. Um, um, it, it was like, uh, Gamer O'Neill, it wasn't the footage that we had problems with. It was more the fact that he wouldn't show the scoreboard. So a lot of people are saying during that Origins gameplay, they were in your stream and they were like, London, please show me the scoreboard. And you were like, Nope, I ain't showing you the scoreboard. Nope. And you you just refuse to like why did you not want to show the scoreboard? But I was getting chatboarded. Show me your scoreboard. Show me your scoreboard. You know when I was streaming on the origin, I was getting chatboarded as well. Um, show me scoreboard. Show me scoreboard. You know because, bro, I'm not a pussy. You think I'm gonna I'm gonna show my scoreboard just for what, people that are um, harassing me to show a scoreboard? Yeah, yeah, I yeah. <laughs> 
I'm yeah. Not, I'm not the type of guy that, bro. Oh, yeah, you believe me and I'll show I, 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 I give you everything I have. That's not work on me, mate. Yeah. Um. So you're saying basically because of the, the chat bot and um, pr pretty much the bot was spamming show scoreboard that know, actually, um, you know, like made you not want to show the scoreboard. Okay. Yeah, so, you know, you guys heard it here. F you heard it from, you know, Aston himself. And you know, one of the reasons why he didn't want to show you guys the scoreboard, he was getting chatbotted. Uh, Gash, thanks for the sub, bro. He was getting chatbotted, and he just, you know, was just angry with the whole thing and just wanted to play his game and, you know, didn't want to have to deal with the, the bots. That's why he didn't show it. So. But have you even seen those exposed videos on YouTube? Like... The people that make exposed, have you seen the guy? Uh, I, I saw one, I, I'm be honest, I saw one of the videos about this guy, um, something head, I don't remember, but basically he made an exposed video saying that he typed in your chat view bot and he immediately got banned from your chat from just typing that one word and other people were saying that you were view botting and you were just skipping over the comments, you weren't reading it and he could mm. tell that you were reading chat and you weren't doing anything about the view bot, so, um, um, yeah, I, I did see that one. I'm, I'm not sure if you're familiar with that one, but there was this one guy that said that, you know, he typed in your chat, he was banned because he said ViewBot, and he made a video about it on um, YouTube. That's the, when I was playing Origin, that's the time yeah. that when my channel was getting ViewBot and ChatBot every single day, you know? Um, the guy that made a video about the Xbox, he's he's 42 years old. And, and when my... Ch how can how can that guy say I'm um I was chatboarding my stream uh, when that when some guy some guy was chatboarding me? Look at that, he's forty two years old and he, he, he's, he's he's talking bullshit. Yeah, yeah, no, I I, I completely understand what you're saying, and, and that's what I'm saying. Um, some of the things that you know I think viewers are not familiar with is. A lot of times, you know, I believe it's it's not this, the streamer doesn't have anything to do with it. Like sometimes you guys come to my chat, someone is view botting me. I have no idea who's doing it, but all I'm trying to do is just have a good stream and play my game. And I can't like let that distract me from what I'm trying to do. You know, if it completely distract me from what I'm trying to do, you're pretty much lost. You know, and um, yeah, you can't let it be like a major distraction. Obviously, like no one wants to be view botted, but that's one of the like bad things that someone can actually view bot you and try to hurt or make your channel look bad. And people will think that you're a, a view botter. And it's kind of good that, you know, Twitch, you know, you guys saw on Twitter that they're actually, you know, trying to crack down on this view bot in and they're going after some of the top um you know, view bot in uh, company. So, you know, we don't know what's going to come out of that, but, um, you know, it looks like it's, you know, hopefully, you know, we don't see a lot more of it in the future, but, you know, sometimes you, you just, especially when you're the victim, it's nothing, it's, it feels like it's nothing you could do about it. All you could do is just report it to Twitch and um, they would tell you, they would investigate, but it's, it's very hard to tell like who's doing it. So like you never have, you would never have proof that it's this exact guy that's doing it. Like not unless it's like some confession, like how, how are you going to get proof? So it's, yeah, it's very, it's pretty difficult, but yeah, I, I, I do understand what what you're saying? Kim, I I came I joined your interview just to re just to give you respect and just to clear this out about this V boy, you know? No, no, no. I I really appreciate you taking the time um coming to speak for like you know I took an hour out of your time. You probably could have been making videos, but you know hopefully this clears up like a lot of the things that you know people have been asking over you know the past six months. Um, so yeah, no, I definitely uh, appreciate you coming on. And I'm basically going to, you know, wrap it up from here. But, yeah, I, I really do appreciate it. And um, um, like... hey, Moni, um, when I, I didn't come here to just to talk about my origins, you came wrong. Um, you know, this people when, when they was making me expose video on me, I was going to go on drama alert. Oh, you were going to go on drama alert? What? Yeah, I was, I was going to prove those people that I don't vivo on Twitch. Just to prove okay. That. And then I realized... People that own this community is full of little kids, you know, full of okay. kids and um, little brain brainless people, you know. They they listen to what other people say, like a sheep. You get it? Yeah, yeah. So, and then I realized this waste of time going drama and just gonna make it make it make it more drama, you know. If I go to that channel, if I go to drama alerts, they, my channel is gonna go more hates. You get it? And it's gonna be, <laughs> I'm gonna be so many more hates. 
Yeah, yeah. Wait, who who is telling you to take it to drama alert though? Uh one of my mods. <laughs> I have I have to have a screenshot of um, <laughs> them. Oh wow! Well, well. Okay. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you, I never be bored on my Twitch channel. I wouldn't even do those type of things. But yeah. right now, I don't give a fuck about what the people say. You know, it's up to you. you can listen to what you can listen to what the people say. But then the day is not gonna affect me. You get it? Nah. I'm not gonna waste my time and arguing with a kid that's in front of the keyboard every day. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. That's why only. That's why I just came to here just to just to talk about my um v boarding on my channel. You know, that's that's it. But I just don't give a, I don't care about my origins game. I just don't care about my uh, my zombie game. You know, I only play just for fun, just to entertain people. You know, just to grow my channel. Yeah, that's yeah. That's why I go for high the, run. There, there, there's, there's nothing. I, like even not what I said. Like even if like I'm not saying you did this. Even if you modded the game, but you claimed that it was just for entertainment or anything. Like no one could argue with it because people mod to test things or not as long as you don't claim it as a world record i i believe that's where people have an issue with it as long as you don't claim it as such um no one can argue with it because people mod all the time but um they don't claim records for modded games and that's that's the the only difference but yeah um i i think that's all i you know i wanted to to say um yeah you definitely um you know answered all the questions and yeah i appreciate you coming on and um you know definitely good luck with your your stream you know doing a pretty good job you know with your stream like the growth that you have gotten over you know the past like five months you know especially since bo3 came out it's been um pretty good and i'm sure you know people who watch you on a regular basis they're enjoying themselves and that's why they continue to watch and you do know that your haters are going to watch, but it's not much you could do about it. Just, you know, just focus on positive things, things that you have control over. You stream, play your game, and, you know, a lot of the other things are just sort of out of your control. But, um, you know, I, I wouldn't, like, dwell on it myself. Like, just, you know, focus on whatever your goal is. And, you know, that's where your energy, you know, should be, you know, geared yeah, to. I'm 21 years old. So I respect most. I respect orders. You know, if you respect, if yeah, you yeah. respect me, I'll respect you. You get it? No, yeah, I, I, I yeah, I, I complete. I, I get it. I completely understand. I'm not gonna. I, I'm not gonna argue with the, with a kid. You know, just to, just to prove that I'm, I don't do this type of things. You get it? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I just completely know yeah. these people, and I just continue streaming and making videos on YouTube. But at the end of the day, my fans are still supporting me. You know, as you can see, look at the last video I posted. Look at the amount of the support I was getting. Um, um, yeah, I, I, I saw the video and I, I, like I said, I even gave the video a like, um, you know, like I, I believe in like honesty and just coming out front, like, you know, like some of the things are out of your control, but, um, a lot of the hate that you did, you know, you did get, you know, I think, you know, it was a little bit over the top, you know, the way, you know, people were typing your chat. I think it was just, you know, it was above the, you know, it was a little bit, you know, a little bit too much. And, you know, hopefully, you know, forward, you know, a lot of you guys are listening to this interview. Um, you guys heard, you know, from, you know, London Project himself and, um, you know, you guys could, you know, form whatever views you guys want to form. But um, like, like what I always tell people, just make a decision based on facts, not n accusations. Just w you wait for the facts and, um, you know, decide based on that and everything else. You know, don't say it as if it was factual, you know, but, um, you know, that's, you know, pretty much, I, you know. All. Like I said on you, if you want to judge someone, just just to get to know them first, you know, you should don't judge them just because what other people say. I know they're going to, I know most of them are going to go to other people's stream and they're going to, other streamers probably doesn't like me. They're going to say bad things about me, you know, Aston Bebo, he modded his game, you know. So don't listen to them. Just, uh, first, just get to know that person, then talk about them. Yeah, yeah. You get what I mean? Yeah, I, I completely, yeah, I completely get it. So if you want to hate on me, that's fine. That's um, that's your opinion. You know, you can you can say whatever you want, but at the end of the day, it's not gonna affect me. So that's that's what I just want to say on you. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I completely get it. But um, yeah. So I'm not gonna take up any more of your time. But yeah, London. I yeah, I appreciate you coming on to doing this interview, and um, you know, good luck with your stream tomorrow if you do decide to stream. Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, that's pretty much it. But yeah, so I'll see you then, Aston. So, All right, then. Uh, before you leave, what do you think about the new map? Um, 
Ah, uh, what do I think about the new map? The I don't normally watch trailers, but actually today, um, you know, a couple of my viewers were like, Gamer Neil, are you gonna watch the trailer on stream? I watched the trailer and the new map looks interesting. It looks very interesting. It's sick blood. <laughs> yeah, it, it looks yeah, it looks like it looks like it's gonna be a good one. But like I said, a lot of times what turns me off with maps is that if it's buggy. Like if that map has death barriers like ZNS, I'm not gonna be playing it until they fix it. Like that's just that's just me. I, I don't wanna deposit gumballs. So yeah, but it, the trailer did look the trailer did look good. Sick. Yeah, it looks yeah. sick, bro. Yeah, but what, do you, what do you think about the old map? It's just about Oshima. Do you think it's gonna be better than that? Uh to be honest with you, I think that's a good map when it's not buggy. <laughs> if it's not buggy with the whole thrashers and everything else, um I, I, I actually like the map. I like the map and a lot of the features that are provided in the map I think are pretty cool. But it's just, it's still too broken for me to take it seriously. Yeah, it's true, it's true. You think, you think that, you think they fixed that, fixed that, um, um, Thrasher? And after, what, uh, how, how it, you yeah, that? the Thrasher, um, yeah. he's, from what I've heard, it's, he's not, you know, his health is not completely fixed yet. But, um, what I'm hoping is, just like how they fixed the Wonder Weapon on Shadows, um, they just go back and reevaluate and, you know, fix the problem with their Thrasher. Damn, if they fix that, it's definitely going to be 200 on that map, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, de definitely. Yeah, definitely a 200 on that but, map. Um, are you going to gonna play solo or are you going to play um, with your viewers when it comes out? I normally play with my viewers and do Easter eggs and stuff like that and normally oh, nice, try to nice. understand the map before I, you know, I go for it solo. But I know you are more of a solo player. But, no, uh, it's like the 150, yeah. you know, and, and the yeah, yeah, the the race for the race for the first hundred. Yeah, go for it. Yeah, go for it. Like I got hundred and fifty one, and I got that little in gold mode thrasher. Then I had to end it. Yeah, yeah, I did see, I did see that game. I think your mm -hmm. game, and then uh, Deniska had a game, and then Steve had a game, and then Scotty had a game, and then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna sit and watch um, before <laughs> I, you know, play high rounds. But I still play co op. The co op games are. Mm. Um, or well, three yeah, players so not gonna get that high. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely see you. So have a good one, Aston. Thanks for letting me join your interview. And, um, not a problem. Respect for that. All right. No problem. All right Thank then. You. Yep. All right, Take bye. it. Take it. Bye bye. All right, guys. So that's you know pretty much the the interview with Aston, guys. You know that's that's pretty much it.